The donation was made part of that country's 58th independence anniversary celebrations. The Central African country, also known as Congo Brazzaville, became independent on the 15th of August 1960. Handing over the magazines, the ambassador of the Republic of Congo to Namibia she explained that her embassy chose the school because it is ranked as one of the top public high schools in the Commerce region and has a high number of female learners which addresses gender disparity. La réponse est aussi simple. Education is an essential part of the bilateral cooperation between Congo and Namibia. We have decided to move away from the usual setting of diplomatic ceremonies and come to an educational setup by bringing a donation of a collection of 500 magazines for the school's library in order to trigger an interest in reading. On her part, Deputy Minister of Education, Arts and Culture, Esther Pondoka, said learners who read books, even for fun, find themselves having an advantage over their peers in certain aspects of learning. Don't look at it and say, this is just a magazine. It is full of information that will liberate your mind and take you to places where you have never been.